다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, dog lovers. Does your dog chew up your shoes or bark for no reason at times? Is it hard to control your dog during walks? You no longer have to worry. We'll help you solve these problems. At the Chester Dog Training Center, we have five professional certified trainers who will improve your dog's behavior. We also teach you how to understand your dog and what to do when it misbehaves. Leave it to the Chester Dog Training Center. We'll train your dog to become a well-behaved pet. Call us at 234-555-3647 or visit our website at www.chesterdogs.com. 1번 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to my video streaming channel. Before we start, I have something to tell you all. In the last episode, I introduced a story from a woman who was seriously injured while she was riding a bike in a mountain and was rescued with the help of a man. Many subscribers to my channel commented that they were moved and wanted to praise the man for what he did. But some mentioned that a photo that was not related to the story appeared on the screen while I was reading the story. They said that the picture was so distracting that they could not concentrate on the story. I sincerely apologize for the problem, and I'll be more careful not to let this happen again in the future. 2번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Well, today is the last day of our intermediate computer programming class. You've all done a great job over the past six months. And now you're one step closer to becoming an expert computer programmer. If you want to elevate your skills to the next level, I encourage you to take the advanced course. As you may have seen on the bulletin board, three very experienced computer programming professionals will instruct you with brand new computers in the computer lab on the third floor. The course begins on the first Thursday of next month. You need to sign up for it on our Education Center website by next Friday. This is a great opportunity to take another step towards your goal. I hope many of you sign up. Thank you. 3번 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, viewers. Thank you for clicking on this video. I'm Malcolm William from Better World Foundation, which provides opportunities for online volunteer projects. Do you want to make a big difference just by using your computer? There are many different things you can do on your computer. For example, you can help wildlife researchers by identifying photos of animals caught in cameras set up to track endangered animals. Or, You can provide blind and low-vision people with visual assistance through live video calls. You don't need to leave your couch to volunteer. All you need is a computer, an internet connection, and a passion for helping others. Please stop by our website for further information and start doing something to make a better world today. 4번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi everyone. At yesterday's staff meeting for promoting our electronics store, you gave some great ideas. As you suggested, I think we need a special event to draw more customers in after remodeling our store. I especially liked your idea of holding a photography contest where people can have a chance to use our new cameras. 
So, there are so many things we have to do to make the photography contest happen, like outlining the contest's basic rules and the application process, and deciding on what prizes to offer the winners. The event needs to be ready to go by the end of this month, so you need to get started on the contest details. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. 5번 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, dear Westville residents. Come and get a good deal on apples for your Thanksgiving celebration. Westside Agricultural Center is having an apple sale this Friday and Saturday, November 18th and 19th. This is the last sale before Thanksgiving. We will not be open during Thanksgiving week, so don't miss this opportunity. Friday hours are noon to 6 p.m., and Saturday hours are 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. We have lots of tasty, juicy, crunchy apples, including Jonah Gold, Gala, Golden Delicious, and Rome Apples. For Rome Apples, you get a 20% discount if you purchase 10 kilograms or more. See our website at www.wsagcenter.com for more details. See you there. 6번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, Cornfill Apartments residents. I'm Sarah Miller, the apartment manager. We are cleaning all the apartment stairs and hallways with water starting at 10 a.m. tomorrow. This will be done by Fast Clean, our apartment cleaning company. They will be using a high-pressure water cleaner and a strong cleaning solution. Please be sure the stairs and hallways are clear of items so they don't get damaged or interfere with the cleaning. The cleaning will start from the top floors and move down. For more information, please refer to the notices posted next to the elevators or visit the management office. Thank you for your cooperation. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, Jonathan looks bored with his toys. I think he needs some new ones. I agree. He's five, but his toys are for younger children. Why don't we try a toy rental service instead of buying toys? How does it work? You pay a small monthly fee and take any toys you want. Then you return them later. Sounds good. That way, we could get Jonathan various new toys without paying much. Besides, renting toys saves space in our house since we won't store his old toys anymore. Wonderful. I guess it's also good for the environment. What do you mean? We could reduce waste by sharing one toy with other families instead of every family buying the same one. Good point. Using this service seems like a good option. Let's try it. 1번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, what are you looking at on your smartphone? A website that sells houseplants. I want to buy one that grows in water. I've recently heard about growing plants in water. They seem to be getting pretty popular. Do you know why? Since they don't need soil, you don't get dirt all over the place. And they have fewer bugs. So they sound good for people with babies because they're cleaner than regular plants. Yeah, that's right. So how often do you have to change the water? You should do it every one or two weeks. That's not bad. They're not only easy to maintain, but some of them are also really decorative because they have really cool-looking roots. Take a look at these pictures. Okay, they look really cool. Let's get one of those. All right.
2번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hey, Scarlett, what's on your mind? Hi, Tyler. I want to take some computer programming classes, but none of the classes offered at school fit my schedule. Oh, I see. Then how about taking online classes? Do you think they're worth it? Definitely. First, you're able to take classes wherever you want. That's true. I could study at home, at a coffee shop, or any other place. Yeah, and you also don't have to commute to school. That would save me a ton of time. For sure. It's financially good, too. What do you mean? You don't have to spend money to commute, and the tuition is usually significantly cheaper than that of face-to-face -face classes. Good point. Taking classes online seems like a good option for me. 3번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Jeremy, how is your new project team? Good. The project is very demanding, but we're doing well. That's good. I saw all of you having tea or coffee together at the first floor cafe yesterday. Oh, did you? Actually, we take a tea break every day. It gives us energy and focus. Then we're ready to get back to work. I bet. For myself, I am always more productive because I feel more alert after taking a tea break. Yeah, my project team feels the same way. And you probably get closer. Right. We always talk about things outside of work, so we've bonded quite a bit. And that definitely helps us work together. That's great. I should suggest to my team that we have regular tea breaks, too. You should. They can be a really important part of work. It sounds like it. 4번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Lydia. How was your weekend? It was good. I stayed home and caught up on sleep. How about yours, Simon? Very relaxing. I read a couple of books. That's good. I know how much you enjoy reading. Yeah, and actually, I recently deleted all of the social media apps on my smartphone. I was wasting too much time on them. Really? I don't think I could do that. But if you got rid of your social media apps, you'd have so much more free time because you wouldn't be constantly looking at your phone. That's true. I do spend a lot of time on social media, especially in bed. If I didn't do that, I could read or even just get to sleep earlier. Exactly. Then you'd be better rested and more productive. Good point. And since social media apps are so distracting, not using them would most likely improve your attention span, too. You've convinced me. I'll remove them from my smartphone. 5번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, John. Hi, Katie. Long time no see. How's the new school you transferred to? Great, but it's really small, so I haven't been able to make many friends with various interests. Well, you can do that outside of school. How? You can join a club or an organization. There must be somewhere you can meet other students with the same interests as you. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. You know what? Volunteering can also be a good way to form a new social network. That makes sense. Since I love animals, maybe I can try volunteering at the local animal shelter. Exactly. Just search online. I'm sure you can find opportunities to expand your relationships outside of school. Thanks for the advice, John. No problem, Katie. 6번 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Josh, why do you look so down? 
Mom, I'm so tired of studying math. Did you like math when you were my age? No, I just couldn't understand why I had to study it when I was young. Neither do I. Well, but now I know why we should study math. I would say it's a great way to strengthen the brain. You sound like my math teacher. She always says that math promotes brain development. Exactly. And just from a more practical point of view, you can have more opportunities by being good at math. What do you mean? I recently read an article that said a lot of employers favor hiring mathematics majors. And the starting salary is usually quite high. Really? Then I should try hard to like math. It can't hurt. 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Monica, have you made plans for your trip to Busan? Yes, Dad. I'm going to the beach and visiting an aquarium in the morning. Then I'll eat lunch at a fish market and go hiking. Hold on. That sounds quite demanding. You know, it's my first trip after starting college. I understand, but I think you shouldn't plan too many things to do for a trip. Well, I only have one day, and I want to experience as much as possible. You'll be worn out if you stick to your plan. Also, consider the time it takes to move to each place. I guess you're right. And there could be a long waiting line at some places. Right. That's why you shouldn't fill your trip plan with too many things. Okay, I'll revise my plan. 1번 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Are you okay, Sam? It seems like something is bothering you. I'm trying to decide on a topic for my science project, but nothing is coming to mind. That must be frustrating. It is. I've been trying to think of something all day. I'm just not a very creative person. That's not true. In my opinion, spending all day thinking about it is the problem. What do you mean? Well, one way to unlock your creativity is to give your brain some time to space out. You mean I should stop thinking about the project? That's right. When you don't give your brain a chance to pause and refresh, it doesn't work efficiently. Really? Yes. That's why you need to get away from whatever you're focusing on and do something else. You're probably right. I'll go and take a walk. 2번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, what is that? It's a sketch of my ideas for updating our living room. I'm thinking of decorating it with houseplants. Really? What types do you have in mind? I'm thinking of putting some flower pots on the floor and hanging some others near the windows. Here, like this. Oh, I see. Why do you want so many plants? They'll make the living room feel cleaner and fresher. How is that? Because they're alive and they help purify the air. I see what you mean. There are also other benefits of having houseplants. They help reduce stress and anxiety and even increase productivity. Wow, I didn't know that. So what do you think about my idea of adding plants to the living room? I love it. 3번 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Ian, can I talk to you for a minute? Sure, Emily. What's up? I'm not sure if it's okay to tell you this, but since we're all friends, I feel like I should. Did you know that Jane is upset with you? Really? I didn't know that. Why is that? You took a picture of her the other day, right? Yeah, but as you know, I always take pictures when we hang out. What's the problem? 
Well, some people may feel uncomfortable about having their photo taken without their permission. Hmm, I haven't thought of that. You and I don't mind having our picture taken, but some people don't like being photographed, especially without their permission. Ah, so that's why Jane is upset. Right. She just hasn't told you directly because she doesn't want to offend you. I see. Thanks for telling me. I'll talk to her about it. 4번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, I'm home. Hey, honey. How was work? It was okay, but I just saw something annoying in the parking lot. What's that? Since our apartment has an underground parking lot, the air quality is pretty bad there. That's true. And since it's getting colder these days, more and more people wait in their car with the engine on to warm up their car, and it makes the air quality a lot worse. Ah, I've seen people do that too. I understand they want to warm up their car, but their car exhaust has no place to go. And we end up breathing the bad air. Yeah. I think people must stop warming up their car in the parking lot. Why don't we tell the management office to post a notice? That's a good idea. 5번 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mom, I've been gaining weight lately. I think I should go on a diet. I noticed you've been eating a lot of junk food. Yeah, so I'm thinking about eating only chicken breasts and tomatoes. That's all you'll eat every day? Yes, experts say they're good weight loss foods. That may be true, but it's important to eat a variety of foods to maintain your immune system's health. But chicken breasts and tomatoes are both healthy. Sure, but nutritionists say that eating the same food every day isn't good for your immune system. Why is that? Because eating a wide variety of foods helps healthy bacteria grow in your body, and that helps boost your immune system. I see. Then I'll try to include a variety of fruits and vegetables in my diet. Good. Let me know if you need my help. All right. Thank you. 6번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Paula. How are your students? Oh, hi, Henry. They're all really nice. But I'm concerned because some of them lack confidence. Have you tried anything to boost their confidence? Not yet, but I've been thinking about trying to have them do some activities they are good at. Well, that might work, but I suggest doing activities that can encourage students to try new things. Could you explain more? How would that help them build their confidence? When children successfully carry out activities that allow them to experience new things, they feel a sense of accomplishment and that boosts their confidence. I get your point, but some of my students seem to really lack confidence. I'm just worried that they'd get too scared to even try. Everyone has their firsts, but I can assure you that once they overcome their fears and manage to succeed at new things, they'll become different people. You're right. I'll think of some activities like you said and try them out. All right. Good luck. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Mr. Newton. Welcome to the Delicacies Show. Thanks for inviting me. I want to first start talking about your famous apple bread. Can you briefly introduce it to our radio show listeners? Sure. Instead of sugar, I use homemade applesauce when I bake bread. That's interesting. What inspired the recipe? Well, one day, I saw a news report about local apple farmers. They were experiencing difficulty due to decreasing apple consumption. 
So you created this new recipe to help the local economy. Yes. I also thought that the apple's sweetness could add a special flavor. Sounds delicious. I'll definitely go to your bakery and try some of your bread. Actually, I brought some for you and your radio show staff. Oh, thank you. We'll be back after a commercial break. 1번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Ms. Anderson. Nice to see you again. Hello, Mr. Davis. Have you talked to your family about the three houses that you looked at last time? Yes. Thanks again for showing them to me. No problem. I feel very rewarded by helping people find the right house. What do you think about them? I thought the one on the hill would be best for you. I love its interior design, and the yard is beautiful, but its price is too high for our budget. Oh, I see. Then how do you like the one near the beach? That's within your budget range, right? Yes. The house is nice, too, and its location is amazing. But I wish it had more bedrooms. Okay. Then how about the one with four bedrooms? I think that one is spacious enough, but it's too old. It needs lots of work to fix it up. I see. Would you like to see any of them again? Yes, the beach house. I'd like to see if I could possibly add space to it by remodeling. Great. I'll call the house owner and tell them we would like to stop by soon. Sounds good. 2번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Ms. Robinson. Thank you for taking time out for us. Hi, Mr. Parker. It's my pleasure. How long have you been taking sports pictures? Almost 20 years. Wow, a long time. What's your favorite sport to take pictures of? Personally, I love taking pictures of ice hockey. The sport is so fast and exciting. What's your favorite part of the job? I'd say being able to catch really brief and intense moments in the games. Cool. You must take a lot of pictures. What do you do with all the pictures you take? I post some on my blog, and I hold an exhibition every year. Nice. Finally, I must congratulate you on winning first prize in the 2022 Sports Photo Contest. Your photos were amazing. Thank you. And I'd like to tell you that I'm a huge fan of your magazine articles. Thanks again for your time. This interview will be in our next issue. I can't wait to read it. 3번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello. Thank you for coming here despite your busy schedule. No problem. We've been visiting a lot of schools for the fire safety drills recently. Glad to hear that. So today, we'll simulate a fire breaking out while using a gas stove in the kitchen. We'll use some smoke bombs, then the fire alarm will go off. Good. Students will feel like there's a real fire. Yeah. Do the students know the evacuation route? Yes. We taught it to them in class this morning. Good. When the fire alarm goes off, we'll stop the class and guide our students along the evacuation route to get outside. Okay. After everyone has evacuated, we're going to make a real fire in the school parking lot and put it out with a fire extinguisher. Great. The students can learn how to use a fire extinguisher. Yeah. Now I'll go back out to the fire truck and get the equipment for the drill. 4번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Ms. White. Thank you for visiting us. Hello. My friend Marsha recommended your company. She said she got a lot of help when her dog got injured. Animal hospital bills can be pretty expensive, so having good pet insurance is important. Yeah, so I'd like to buy insurance to cover any unexpected costs related to my dog. 
Can you go over your company's plans? Sure. First, please write down your dog's breed, age, and type of coverage you want on this form. Okay. All the plans offer accident and illness coverage, right? Not all of them. We offer three types of pet insurance, so you can choose the right type for your pet's needs. I see. After you fill in the form, I'll describe them in detail. Okay. 5번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hi, I'm Julie Johnson. I called you about the ad in the paper this morning. Hello, Ms. Johnson. Come on in. Thanks. I've never been to a ceramic studio before. Wow, you have so much beautiful pottery. Thank you. Feel free to look around. Can I take some pictures of these cute ceramic animals? Sure, go ahead. They were in my exhibition last month. I remember seeing them. Actually, I became really interested in pottery after going to your exhibition. Oh, really? I'm so flattered. Your ad says you're offering a pottery class for beginners. I'd like to sign up for it. Okay. The class starts next week. It's four weeks long, and it meets every Monday at 6 p.m. That's great. I'll sign up. All right. I'll get you a sign-up form. 6번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Ms. Baker. You look busy today. Hi, Justin. Same as always. I'm just writing an article for the local newspaper. How do you like your coffee and muffin? They're excellent as usual. Your hand drip coffee at this coffee shop is the best. The one you're drinking now is from the new coffee beans we got in. I love it. It tastes great. You always use fresh beans, roasted perfectly. Thanks for saying that. Did you try the method I told you about for brewing coffee at home? Yes, your tips really worked. The water temperature was the key, as you said. Great. I learned about temperature when I first got trained. When did you get your certificate? About 10 years ago. That's why you know so much about coffee. By the way, I'd like to buy some of the new beans to take home. Okay, I'll get you a bag. 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Wow, Ms. Peters, it looks like everything is ready for the exchange student welcoming ceremony. Almost, Mr. Smith. What do you think? It looks great. There's a basket beside the stairs. What is it for? We're going to put flowers in it for the exchange students. That'll be nice. I like the striped tablecloth on the table. It makes the table look fancy. Yeah, I'm going to put water bottles there. What do you think about the balloons next to the welcome banner? They really brighten up the stage. Oh, look at the bear on the flag. It's cute. Yes, it's the symbol of the exchange student's school. I see. And you set up two microphones. It's because there'll be two MCs. Good idea. Everything looks perfect. 1번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Brian, look at this. This is the picture of the pool villa we're going to stay at on our honeymoon. Wow, it's beautiful. We can sunbathe together on these two sunbeds. Yeah, and isn't the rectangular pool in front of the sunbeds awesome? It really is. We can jump in it and cool off whenever we want. I like the folding door for the bedroom, too. Yeah. We can keep it open during the day, like in this picture, and close it when we sleep. Right. We can just unfold it when we're inside. This round sunshade will be nice to use if the sunlight is really strong. Definitely. We can have some tropical fruit drinks on the sofa under the sunshade. That sounds cool. It is the perfect place for our honeymoon. I agree. I can't wait.
2번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Tommy, we made it back to the foot of the mountain. That was a fun hike, wasn't it? Yeah, I loved it. Now I'm starving. How about eating at this restaurant? Okay, they have a menu on the outside wall. They serve various kinds of food. That's great. And there is a tree in the dining area. It seems to block out the sun. Yes. Why don't we take the empty round table surrounding the tree? All right. Look, the bear statue is holding a welcome sign. The statue is fitting because there used to be a lot of bears in this area. I didn't know that. Look at the vegetable garden with the fence. They probably cook with what they grow here. The food must be really fresh. Yeah, I can't wait to try it. Let's get seated at the table now. Okay. 3번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Come on in, Jenny. Thanks for coming over. Hi, Ben. Thanks for inviting me. Wow, I love your living room. Thanks. I recently remodeled it. That bookcase behind the sofa is so cool. It's covering the whole wall. That's where I used to have the TV. This is way better. And I like the light hanging from the ceiling. It looks like a star. It's pretty cool, right? I bought it because I liked the unique design. Amazing! Where did you get that picture of birds on the wall? Actually, I took that picture when I climbed a mountain in Europe last summer. Awesome! The round coffee table goes well with the living room. You think so? Yes, and it perfectly matches the heart-shaped rug under the table. I'm glad you noticed. That's what I was going for. 4번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. You keep smiling. What are you looking at? I'm just looking at some pictures of my camping trip last week. I had such a good time. Oh, can I take a look? Sure. This is the picture of my campsite. I camped alone. Wow, the tent even has a window in the center. It looks like a small cottage. Doesn't it? The tent felt like home. Did you do some bird watching? I see the binoculars on the camping chair. Yeah, I saw so many types of birds while I was there. That must have been fun. Oh, I see you made a campfire in front of the tent entrance. Did you buy firewood or just collect it there? I picked up some branches and leaves around the campsite. Great. By the way, what was that camera hanging in the tent entrance for? Your smartphone already has a good camera, doesn't it? Yes, but I needed the higher quality camera to take pictures while bird watching. I see. Oh, the motorcycle to the left of the tent must be the one you've told me about. That's right. I left my car at home and rode my motorcycle to the campsite. 5번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Ms. Morgan, how was the weekend field trip to the woods with the students? Were the cabins okay? It was fun. And yeah, the cabins were really nice. Here's a picture I took. Two students shared a cabin, right? Yes. Each cabin has a bunk bed, like this. Wow. They have blinds on the window. I was told that those are new and that they used to have curtains. That's nice. And it is good that each room has a small refrigerator under the window. Yeah. Students must have liked it because they could store their own food and drink in their own room. And what's this next to the refrigerator? That's a vacuum cleaner. I see. The couch against the wall on the right is pretty big. Yeah, it is big enough for two students to share. I love it. 
6번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. David, did you have a good time at the outdoor pool on Sunday? Yes. My family played and ate delicious food all day long. Would you like to see a picture? Of course. See this water slide with a picture of a dolphin on it? My son loved it. It's good that no one was waiting in line on the water slide stairs. Yeah. The boy coming down the slide wearing the swimming goggles is my son Peter. He went up and down the slide all day. <laughs> I can imagine. What were you doing in the water? I was standing at the end of the slide waiting for Peter to come down. That's fun. It's nice there are sunbeds to rest on. Yeah, but unfortunately, they don't have parasols. I see, but it looks like you had a great time there. We sure did. You should go there sometime. 대화를 듣고 남자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Brian, I'm so excited about our school club photo this Friday. Me too. The photo will be included in our graduation album. Let's check our preparations for it. All right. I'm going to decorate our club's room with ribbons. You said you'll bring some from home, right? Yes. When is the photographer coming? The photographer is coming after lunch. Great. That gives us time to get ready. You know I surveyed our club members about what to wear for the photo. Right. What were the results? Most of our members wanted to wear heart-shaped sunglasses. Now all that's left is to buy them for our members. I know a good online store. I can order the sunglasses. Could you? That'll be great. No problem. I'll take care of that. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mom, what are you doing with all those lemons? Are you making your special lemon preserve for tea? Yes. Awesome. I love your lemon tea. It looks like you're making a lot. Yeah, because I'm going to give some away as gifts for the upcoming holiday. Good idea. Whoever you give it to will love it. Let me know if you need any help. I can wash the lemons for you. I already washed them. I was just about to clean the glass jars I'll put the lemons in. You mean by boiling them, right? Yes, that's the best way. Well, then while you do that, I can slice up the lemons. Thanks, but I'll do that when I'm done with the jars. Actually, I don't think there's enough sugar. Okay. I'll go out and get some now. I can pick it up at the supermarket on the corner, right? Sure. Thank you. 2번 대화를 듣고 여자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Dad, what are you doing? I'm removing the labels from these plastic bottles. Are we supposed to do that to recycle them? Yeah, we are. I didn't know we should be doing that. Can I give you a hand? Thanks, but I'm almost done. Then I can take them to the recycling area. It's okay. I'm going to take them out when I go to the grocery store. Oh, but the laundry is in the dryer now. Do you want me to take care of it? That'd be great. It'll be done in about 15 minutes. Okay, I'll take the laundry out and fold it when it's done. Thanks. 3번 대화를 듣고 남자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Grace. How's the preparation for the interview going? Hi, Jacob. I've been working on it all morning. Do you need help with anything? Possibly. Let me think about what still needs to be done. Well, I can see you've set up the chairs and tables. Yes, that's taken care of. Have you printed out the applicants' resumes for the interviewers to look at? Yes, they're that pile of papers on the table. Okay, that's good. Oh, I guess the interviewers want to film the interviews, 
but I don't know how to set up the camera. I've done that before. I'll take care of it. Thanks so much. I'll sort the applicants' resumes for the interviewers. All right. 4번 대화를 듣고 여자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Andrew, I just got a call from Professor Robinson. What did he say? He said he'd be here in about an hour. We need to hurry up and finish preparing for his special lecture. Okay, let's do it. I already placed a microphone on the desk on stage. All right. And I set up the laptop. We still need to prepare the lecture materials. Have you copied the materials that he emailed? Not yet. He just sent them a little while ago. I just downloaded them. Okay, I'll take care of that. How many copies should I make? Twenty. Here's the file. All right. Lydia, someone is dropping off the banner in the lobby in about ten minutes. The banner needs to be picked up. Could you do that for me? I will take care of it right now. Thanks. 5번 대화를 듣고 여자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Lucas, what time did you get home last night? Around 10.30. I was preparing for the science festival. I see. There's something I wanted to ask you last night, but I ended up falling asleep before you got home because of the cold medicine I took. Oh, what did you want to ask me? I wanted to know if you'd prepared a birthday present for Mom. Her birthday is this Saturday. Actually, I bought a scarf for her last weekend. My friend Sarah helped me choose it. Nice. Have you written a birthday card for her, too? Yeah. Have you bought her a present yet? I'm going to order flowers today. I'm having a bunch of roses delivered on Saturday morning. What a good idea! Mom is going to love our presents. 6번 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자에게 부탁한 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mark, how's preparing for the interview going? Have you finished making interview questions for the new club members? Yeah, I completed making them yesterday. Have you uploaded the club's promotional video on the bulletin board at our school website? Yes, it's been up for a week, but it hasn't gotten many views. Maybe it's because students don't use the bulletin board much. I think you're right. Then we should try to find another way to let students know about our club. Why don't all our club members visit classrooms to promote it? That's a good idea. Then we can share our personal club experiences with the students. Yeah. Let's have a club meeting later today and talk about it. Okay. So, could you contact the members and tell them to come to the club room after school? I'll make handouts for the meeting. All right. I'll tell them it starts at 4 p.m. Great. Thanks.